it's never been apparent to me that when I'm camping, I always need to charge my devices. And when you have a little something like this, let me tell you, it's really handy. This is a the rigid battery pack. It has this thing is actually pretty awesome. So the regular charging port on the back of the device takes 120 volts. <laughs> There's two USB ports and then a USB-C charger. So it's pretty simple how this works. You can see that there is a little rigid on the bottom. You take a rigid battery, preferably, you know, a charged rigid battery. You slot it in, and boom, it's that simple. So turn it on here. You can hear the fan spinning, but that only lasts for a couple seconds. It's pretty silent. And then it also has a little flashlight, which is uh, pretty nice. And once it's on, you can go ahead and pretty much plug any device in that you would like, including a laptop, as long as you have a fully charged battery. Overall, the power inverter is pretty good. Um, it's a nice, you know, slim shape, as you can clearly tell. I really do like the way it looks. It looks clean, it looks slick. And you can kind of just slot it in just like that. It's simple as pie. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? We've been using this for a couple of months now, and it's already been impossible to go back to using battery banks that you obviously can't change the batteries of and you have to charge. And that's another thing that this thing is going for. You don't have to charge it every single time you want to use the thing. You, you can just grab a new rigid battery and, sl and slot it in. Uh-oh, my battery is done. Let me just slide it out real quick. It's as simple as that. And the one that we have right here is a 18-volt Bluetooth hyper-octane. So, yeah. It's fully charged as well, so... Yeah. So with that being said, the power inverter is a very useful little tool to have around the house. And to demonstrate how this works, I'm going to show you it off right now. Let's go. For this demonstration, we're going to be using our power inverter. And we have a Samsung Flip Z. So there's obviously a couple ways we can go around doing this. You can use the 120 amp brick feature. We won't experience, we won't be experiencing full power out of that, but you know, we plug it in, turn it on, and it's charging as you can uh, if you can't already tell. Now we can test the USB functionality of this uh, power inverter, so we can plug it in if it will actually face the screen face the camera get all the get all the cable and now we can try to USB functionality and it's charging almost instantaneously it's as easy as that the rigid power inverter is great go buy one um if it's on sale we'll leave a where to buy link down below but uh yeah i think that's all i have to say so thank you guys for watching this rigid power inverter video it's a bit of a different one because obviously we don't review rigid products here but we decided to give it a shot. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like. If you didn't like the video, you can go ahead and dislike it. I don't know why I gave two dislikes, but yeah. Uh, if you want to comment down below, if you have any questions about this video, you can go ahead and comment down below. It's going to be awesome. Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy your power inverter like we like our power inverter.